Hello YouTube and the World Wide Web. This is Check It Dude of SniperGaming.org. Here we are today in GTA 5 and we're going to show you a race that we created. Um, you press your start button and you go over to online and you uh, I go to jobs I haven't saved. So, we going to have a good week boss? The name of the race is Trophy Trucks when it's technically a stunt race but it only has speed boosts and a few uh, standard uh, ramps. This is a race you can win or lose. Um, it's, a, it's, a, it's, a, it's a game you can win if you go hard but it's also a game you can lose if you go hard. Um, it's normally two laps. We're going to go one for the video. It's going to be uh, a quick video. Um, we're going to turn the radio off here. Custom vehicles are allowed. Um, we're going to play by myself just to show you the race. This this uh, race was designed for the trophy truck. Um, it technically allows um, anything off-road to see all the different vehicles, but you don't want to do anything with two wheels. The motorcycles cannot finish this race, as a lot of other vehicles probably cannot finish either. And the reason is, is the deep water. They have no chance in the deep water. So I will confirm that and we'll continue that. Um, can't bet on myself too bad. The best uh, lap in this race recorded so far is six minutes and under one second. And that has to be a mistake free race. Every mistake uh, on average will cost you five to six seconds. There's only one speed boost there, so you can imagine the, the people compete for it. Um, it can be some bump in there. And a couple more speed boosts here, and you know you go up and fit. Uh, for Zancudo. Oh, I didn't make it. Usually you fly pretty, like, all the way across the airline airport. Um, for whatever reason, it just didn't make it that time. But it's a fun flight, trust me. And you do make it over that fence clean about 90 to 95% of the time. I would say this is some kind of security path for uh, for the base, and it behooves you, trust me, to go slow over this bump. You can lose some time there if you if you end up uh, rolling it, get stuck on the wall. And this is a tough one to nail just right, and it looks like I did go around these fans here. And it's another checkpoint here. Now easy here. Don't go too fast because you go flying too far over the checkpoint and over the buses. So this is a race that it takes, a, it takes a little bit of practice to get good. There's some bumps and things that can tip you over. And obviously there was a spot right there you need to know about if you went too fast, which is your natural inclination to go really fast. You fly over the checkpoint, over the buses, and you lose a, a crap load of time. There's a nice jump there. Now, uh, if you like this video, don't forget to like or subscribe. You can find us on uh, www.snipergaming.org. I hope I said that right. Um, anyway, here's a tricky one here, this ramp. Um, it pays. This ramp can s is the fastest way if you know how to do it. But you don't really lose it much time, if, all, if any, if you just go to the right of that ramp. But if you're going to take that ramp, you want to kind of go off that ramp off to the right a little bit so you don't hit those outcroppings of ledge. And it's tricky to do. And there's some risk there because if you screw up your end up on your on your hood or your roof and you lose five, six, seven, eight, nine seconds. So far, I'm on pace to hit the record, or be right near it, but it only takes one mistake and you're done. And right, right there's a tough spot. You go, if you went to the left a little bit right there, it wouldn't be such a tough graduation. You could, you could uh, slope right up if I forgot to go left. This, 
these these jumps in this race, there's no guarantee you're going to make them. You got to keep your wheels on the ground. You got to keep your speed up. And I barely made that one. Almost didn't make it. Sometimes you can really hit that sucker and land it right down the road. You know, it's all about when the wheels are on the ground. All right, here's a tricky spot here. Um, when you go right here, hug this telephone pole and go slow. Because if you went fast or a little bit to the left, you'd go over the crown of the hill and the gravity wouldn't allow you to come back. You'd lose several seconds there. But it is before some of these jumps you have to have your speed up so you, you got to know when to step on the gas and when not to it's about throttle control if you step on the gas at the wrong time you actually lose speed before the jump and you're screwed you're not going to make it you got to step on the gas when the tires are in the ground here's another one here you got to lift you lift you lift you get up here I think I nailed it. I had enough speed to make it to the road. And that's a really hard one. There's no the success rate of that is, is, for me, it's decent. But for anybody just trying this race for the first time, because I've raced this so many times when I was creating it, of course, I'd have to test it and test it and test it. So I know where all the little hitches are. I've had people come on here and beat me, but, I've, you know, but I still have the, the course record for lap time. Here's a tricky one here too. If uh, if you go, if you take your left at this checkpoint right here too early and try to go across that cove, even with this truck, the truck won't make it. It'll drown. You have to wait a little second. I found it better not to even try to cross that cove. I just go around. I think it's probably just as fast. We're doing really good. We're getting near the end, and uh, as long as I don't mess up. 524. I don't see how I'm going to make this actually. I'm going to go slower down here because this is, this is punishing. Sometimes coming off this, you really mess up. So I'll, I'll lose a second on purpose to uh, you know, not cost myself several. Landed on my roof on the beach there. You can hit that top speed and make it just fine. I, I do a lot, but when I'm close to hitting the record like I am now, um, no, no, it doesn't look like I'm going to make the record. But, uh, it's a pretty good lap. chance and I hit that one which is great I can finish strong 6.08 or 9 good lap it's a good race it's a lot of fun again like share this video um, subscribe to our channels and you can catch us on snipergaming.org uh, on the front the home page there's a uh, all kinds of links to catch just all over social media including discord as a matter of fact on this video there's a link to discord so you could jump in discord with us anytime you like and talk with us and play with us so we, you know we have some games going on we have iRacing we have the grand theft auto and and, and more coming um well, i hope you enjoyed the video